Hi there, my name is Laura Johnson and I am a graduate of the U of A. did a Bachelor of Arts in Modern Languages and Cultural Studies with a major in French and Spanish and a minor in International Studies. As an art student, you get a lot of questions about what are you going to do after you finish. I really wanted something, some kind of a co-op program where I could get a little bit of work experience before I graduated. After three years of studying in a Bachelor of Arts program, I wanted to take the skills that I learned in the classroom and apply them to a job. Um, so I was able to do that perfectly. In an arts degree, you learn how to write really effectively. So you write tons of papers. And so I was excited to be able to bring that to a work position where I'd be writing emails and reports constantly. In an arts degree, you do a lot of presentations, especially as a French and Spanish major. You also learn how to communicate effectively. I, and I was definitely able to bring that to my work experience. In the Arts Work Experience program, you find a job where you work full time. My internship was four months, which meant that I did have to postpone my degree by four months. But I can honestly say that the payoff is so worth it. I graduated having that four months uh, work experience that I wouldn't have had anywhere else if I hadn't postponed my degree, uh, which kind of gave me a leg up on all the other arts graduates that I was graduating with. I learned a ton of skills that have helped me in my current position that I'm at right now. It's a paid position, so it helps, helps with your tuition, any student loans that you might have. All in all, I am so glad that I decided to do the Arts Work Experience program and postpone my degree by those four months because the payoffs have been huge for me. If not just to mention the confidence that it instilled me in going out and finding a job after I graduated. Instead of being on my own trying to find a job after I graduated, I felt completely supported throughout the whole process. It helped me find a job that would teach me a lot and where I could do really, really well. From there, I had a, a resume and a cover letter workshop where I learned how to tailor my resume to the job description. I learned how to write a really effective cover letter for the first time in my life. Before I got the interview with, uh, with the job, I did a mock interview where I went in and practiced interviewing for the job that I was applying for. They actually had similar questions um, that would be asked in the interview, so I was able to really prepare. I think in the past I'd always kind of just decided to wing interviews and just do my best, and this really forced me to kind of sit down and think about what I was going to say in the interview. As a result, I felt like I, I did really well at the interview. I felt completely prepared. I wasn't even especially nervous, which is new for me too. I felt more prepared getting this past job than I ever have in any other job. So the job that I applied for was working as a recruiter for the University of Alberta and in many ways this uh, was a perfect match for me. I was expected to connect with high school students and their parents and their counselors by traveling around and talking about my experiences both as an art student as, and as a U of A student in general promote the U of A and talk about um, all of their different programs. So uh, when I wasn't traveling, I was in the office answering student emails, meeting one-on-one -on -one with students, and it was really great again because I got to use all of those skills that I learned in my arts degree and really excel at a, at a real-life type job. I think one of the coolest things about the Arts Work Experience program is that you're completely supported throughout the whole process. The career development officer helped me find a job that was well suited to my interests and well suited to what I wanted to, to get out of the experience. Helped me write learning objectives before the placement began and checked in with me periodically throughout the placement to make sure that I was feeling really comfortable. And I just really felt that someone else had invested in my career. So I felt like I had that extra level of support, extra someone to really care about my career.